There's a little problem with the RD8 in that this ability to use a trigger out, so that, that's the accent trigger out. So if I make, if I put trigs on all these accents, then it should trigger the MS-101 one step at a time for each accent. And then I can make, you know, funky beats that are maybe seven trigs out of 16. And so it'll sound different every time, kind of like a guy called Gerald did. Now, what you can do is you can run this trig out and then run it into an envelope, which I've done here uh, on the modular, and then into the MS-101. And you can get a long enough trig to advance the sequencer. But right out of the box, the RD8 uh, just has a spike coming out of there and not uh, like a square wave type of shape. But I saw a guy named Mafez uh, came up with this idea of using a capacitor, a one microfarad capacitor, and a little diode. And so I'm going to make myself a special trigger wire to do the guy called Gerald type of sequencer advance. Okay, so here are the parts I'm using. Um, a little modular connector wire that I had, the one microfarad capacitor, and the diode. Hit play over there and play this and put just any random steps in there. 